101 ESPN. Welcome to 101 ESPN.com. I'm Brian Feldman here on a windy day at Roger Dean Stadium, and this is the final practice, a full day of practice, because tomorrow the Cardinals are going to Port St. Lucie for the opener of the Grapefruit League action against the New York Mets. It'll be Evan McLean starting for the St. Louis Cardinals and Tony La Russa and Dave Duncan. They do not want to start pushing guys like Chris Carpenter and Adam Wainwright, so they want to cut back on their starts in spring training, so they'll give the start to a guy who will most likely will be in AAA Memphis and Evan McLean to give him a little bit more exposure. Now, the traveling roster is attached on my blog, but the notable names of players not going to Port St. Lucie, Albert Pujols, Yadier Molina, and Matt Holiday, among others. And Tony is really just trying to give some of those guys a break so they don't have to go on some of these road trips. But starting on Friday when the Cardinals have their opener here at Roger Dean Stadium, you better believe you will see Albert Pujols and Matt Holiday and Yadier Molina, among others, in the Cardinals lineup. Now, as far as some of the news from today, Got a chance to talk with Tony La Russa earlier this morning, and two main things stuck out to me. First and foremost, Alan Craig is someone Tony says can hit his way onto the 25-man roster. We were talking with Tony about players and some of their defensive positions and what they need to do as far as showing versatility. But Tony says with Alan Craig, he really just said he can hit his way on because Alan Craig is someone who came up really as a third baseman, but they moved him away and he started playing more first base and left field. Well, obviously with Albert at first and Matt Holiday in left, he's not going to be able to do much as far as playing those positions in the major leagues. But he had such a fantastic season offensively in Memphis hitting well over 300, well over 20 home runs, and he was the organization's minor league player of the year. They say that he can, again, hit his way on to the opening day 25-man roster. Now, one other thing Tony La Russa did talk about, Julio Lugo, Tony said that he looks outstanding. He looks 10 years younger, and he has come in fantastic shape to spring training, so they are really impressed so far with what they've seen from Julio Lugo. So keep it here on 101 ESPN, and of course, 101ESPN.com for all the latest updates right here from spring training.